My name's Nick Radburn, we're here at Joseph Leckie Community Technology College on the 27th of May 2011 uh, and we're going to attempt to break the land speed record for a model rocket car which stands at the moment at about 33.5 metres per second. Trevor started um, at Joseph Leckie two years ago and he came to me at the start of the year as I took over as head of uh, department and he said what do you think about me doing a display about Bloodhound? And that's how it started. I, I've been a fan of the, the land speed record um, since I was a small child. But when it really got serious for me was um, in 1998, I think it was, um, Richard Noble and Andy Green brought uh, Thrust SSC uh, to South End. It was being up close to that magnificent machine that really inspired me to uh, to take a greater interest. We had a talk off the Bloodhound and since then we've had constant support on uh, the type of bearings, the type of wire, the type of model, the axles. They've just fed us as much information as we can for our model. The top name here is my uh, dead father uh, and the bottom name is uh, Trevor's granddaughter who he has also sponsored to go on to the actual Bloodhound car that he's going to attempt the 1,000 mile an hour. But once we fire the rockets, it will start moving. It'll actually start picking up a lot of speed, and then it'll pass through the light gate. The light gate is a simple electrical circuit, and uh, you're going to have a light ray going through, and from that we can work out the speed of the rocket. Well, one of our teachers is going to be on the laptop, um, recording the speed so we're gonna find out from him how fast we've done it and then we're gonna if it's, it comes out in meters per second so we'll have to um, calculate it and then get in miles per hour. The idea is that this goes along a hundred meter course held low to the ground by a wire and the record will stand if we can make this car go more than 75 miles an hour. Shake that. just made the complete school a buzz of excitement. It's not just about being in the classroom, it's about how you can apply this knowledge in an interesting and fun way. It's just changed their view about how exciting things like maths and physics, which are traditionally the boring subjects. We're ready. Are you ready kids? Here we go. We want to try and break a world record. Five! Well, we have a result now. You knew that the target to beat was 75 miles an hour average. Now, the results are in, and you have done 88 miles, 92, and you get a spell for call. Next year we get beating, yeah? Yeah. <laughs>